Former Democratic Unionist Party leader Dr Ian Paisley has died aged 88. His wife Eileen said in a statement that her beloved husband passed away this morning. Ian Paisley was a hardline Protestant cleric and served as Northern Ireland's First Minister in 2007 and 2008, representing the country's largest unionist party. He was known for his wild political views and for being a strong, charismatic leader, opposing successive political deals, including the Anglo-Irish and 1998 Good Friday agreements. In this dark hour of treachery. Paisley was elected to Westminster in 1970 as a Protestant Unionist MP and a year later founded the DUP. He played a key role in orchestrating the Ulster Workers' Council strike which brought Northern Ireland to a standstill in 1973. I'm talking about getting the structural organisation of a group of men that will stand shoulder to shoulder and will be prepared when the crunch comes to offer themselves, please God, to a government that will chase the rebels forever over the border. His views on the Catholic Church caused controversy in 1979 when he notoriously called Pope John Paul II the Antichrist. Despite this, he's been praised as the politician who finally cemented Northern Ireland's peace process when he said yes to sharing power with his sworn enemies in Sinn Féin. Day ...because we're making a new beginning. And I believe we're starting on a road which will bring us back uh, to peace and to prosperity. Paisley became seriously ill in 2004 but continued to be a towering figure in Northern Ireland's politics until 2008 when he retired. He is survived by his wife and two sons. His family intend on holding a private funeral which will be attended by the immediate family.